So the the brainstorm informs what you're going to write, um, but that's just one piece. So from those brainstorming sessions, what we will typically do is take all of the content ideas that we came up with and map them to the buyer's funnel, so or the buyer's journey. So making sure that you have content pieces to bring people in at the awareness level, to convert them, um, that you have sort of bottom of the funnel. So making sure that that is all covered. And it's not just the new ideas that we thought of in that session that I take into consideration. It's mm -hmm. any viable content that exists that is still good and current. And it might be something that can be used as is. It might be something that needs to be updated. Um, and then you had mentioned derivative content before. Mm -hmm. That's absolutely where you can take a really core meaty piece and then maybe create some high level awareness level pieces for that as well. Um, so once I mapped out to the buyer's journey, I see are there holes, there could be additional conversations that you know need to happen and, and those holes need to be filled in. Um, but once we ensure we have coverage across the buyer's journey, then there's things to take into consideration like a product launch or an event that you need to have content for or um, any big things happening throughout the year that might affect timing of content or it might affect, um, you know, maybe you need some things before it and then you need some things after. So those definitely inform when we create things. Um, and then I always want to think about what is the journey that we want people to go on. So when is when somebody reads this piece, what is the next piece and what is the next piece? And that will inform when you need to create things. So the anchor content that eventually everyone will go to needs to actually be created first, even though your visitor might see that awareness level piece first because you have to have where to link them to and where to link them to. So that also informs um, kind of how we put things on a calendar.